and see what the fuck we're actually doing. And oh, oh, hi, friends. We're doing art today. Hello. So, everyone else, Tom fuckered off the AX. Yep. So, every uh, so here's the thing. There's gonna be fan art on this stream. Not everyone who's here who normally gets into their characters is going to be here. So if you got comics, we'll show them off. Chances are we're probably not going to read them right now. Especially, guys, there's nuggies here, okay? He, what, this man needs fuck? his nuggies. The, I have not eaten yet. You're He's going to beat me again if he doesn't get to eat his nuggies. No, you're going to deprive me of my nuggies? What the fuck? He's going he's gonna to hit me even harder. And I just, I just want him to have his nuggies. It's going to happen. It is. I'm here just because. I'm also going to throw this packet of sweet and sour sauce at Stefan if I don't have my nuggets. <laughs> and I don't even like that sauce. So. That's, yeah, that's, that's, that's the, the point. That's why. <laughs> he wasn't going to throw you honey mustard. I, I do not like honey mustard at all. So Ketchup. See, see, no, here's the thing is that Ketchup's I fine. ordered. Okay. No, listen. So here's the thing is you, you told me that. It's just like, do they have honey? And I'm like, well, they have honey mustard. And I'm like, and he tells me, well, then I don't want anything. And I'm just like, how funny would it be if I just ordered it anyway with your nuggies? <laughs> <laughs> then no one would eat the, the sauce. And then it'd just go to waste. Starving kids in Africa could have eaten that Th sauce. That's right. That's, that's Specifically correct. Specifically just the sauce. And, yeah, and just it, the sauce. And it would have stayed on your desk. And you would have had to had that in your conscience for the rest of the day. Yeah. <laughs> Every time you don't eat the sauce, it causes an earthquake in China. <laughs> That's what my grandpa told me. Every time you don't eat your every time you don't eat your veggies, uh, it causes an earthquake in China. And I was like, oh my god, okay. Fucking kid, you gotta eat the sauce. <laughs> I was like four. I didn't know. I thought I was killing thousands of people by not eating my asparagus. You know, I heard that if you don't eat the barbecue sauce with your chicken tenders, that has a butterfly effect uh, in I Japan. Know. That's right. <laughs> Just thousands of innocent people destroyed. Someone said they can't hear me. Is this better? Do I need to get closer to the mic? Oh, you know what? I was... Uh oh, did we shut that off? No. I'm using the landing mic. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> the McNuggie sauce I was effect. on that mic yesterday. Nab. I had to... Oh, uh, okay. I had to, I had to boost it down. Nab, thank you for them bits. I see that, that McNuggie fun thing you just did. McNuggie fun. That's not even a thing he actually posted. I'm... No, the McNuggy Fun. The McNuggy Fun's real. That was my favorite episode of McKids. <laughs> Don't you mean the Burger King kids with wheels? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> didn't wheels at the end of their fucking lifespan, like of that show or that, that cartoon? No, he didn't die. He got a rocket powered wheelchair. Yes. He went from uh -huh. wheels to Abs hover. Yes. Yes. I believe that is canon to the to the greater lore. We have fan art. <laughs> Marvel Poison. Thank you for this. Very lovely rendition of it and Nedra. It's That's adorable. Cute. Fairy dragon where his 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 skin secretion releases narcotics. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Yep. Sounds like I need one. That's why uh that's why you always take a free hit. Oh man. No free a free it. A free it for a free hit. <laughs> so Retro Renegade, thank you for this onslow picture. Look at look at all the stuff this man has killed, and I apologize. Like I said, these two are very un un uh, knowledgeable of TFS at the table stuff, so I will do my best. No, to that's like a tarot card looking thing. That's cool. It is a tarot card, yeah. That's neat. Yeah, but I I, I will have very little to say. <laughs> I'm yeah. just sort of a that, body. That, that's Act why like you know exactly what what it is. Yes. No. Make up lore. <laughs> that's the key to make up everybody lore. loving you. And then uh, I'm so far away from the names, it's terrible. Uh, Caesar Morales. Yep, Caesar Morales. At, at Zega Ex Exeron. Thank you for this very lovely, lovely Nedra. This little tiny Nedra. She's gonna punch it, and it's adorable. That's cute. My dumb, my my dumb. My favorite thing about this character is that when I told Art Jack to do the description for, her, I uh -huh. said it's the girl from the ring on Pixie Sticks. I think that's good. That's good. I like both those things. Uh oh, here's some Nuzlocke stuff. Oh yeah. Uh, this is from uh, Trent Smith, T Smith five six seven six. Yeah, this is everybody freaking out that the right you might know surf, <laughs> and oh that that yeah. Why would a right you know surf? <laughs> but hey, it saved it saved a person. I like the expressions. I like Grant. I like Grant's eyeballs. <laughs> Grant went fucking Brendan Small for a minute. Yeah, yeah, tiny <laughs> bit. R reminds me of like w one of the Rick and Morty characters. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know which one you're talking about. Yeah. Also, I love that everyone in the chat is calling you now William Smith. 
because oh, of what you did on Tuesday. That's who I am now? <laughs> yep, this is who you are now, Stefan. You Welcome are now Earth. William Smith. <laughs> oh, jeez. From... Oh, that's cute. Oh, uh, God. Uh, Rebecca Carolla. Rebecca Carolla. Thank you very much. I know what this is. This is it, and this is from The Unexpectables. This is uh, this is our pet Drake Tarisk. Oh, that's cute. So the two pets converging in one universe. Oh, boy. From Blue Pest. A while ago, recently got around to inking it. Oh, yeah, it's my ex. <laughs> a, very, a very good version. I like that. I like the shading. The mustaches. So I have a question. Is the sunflower hat part of the goop? Yes. So it, it just crafted it from its own goop. Have you seen, do you know like that, that jelly girl from Monster Musume? She can like make all that stuff. You know that, right? You love Monster Musume. I, I guess I guess I That's do right. now, uh -huh. Kieran. You do. <laughs> it's it's your favorite. I've been to your place. I know how you have all the volumes. <laughs> that and the horse one. What's that one? Pretty, yeah. Pretty Derby? Yeah, and Pretty Derby. Pretty Derby. <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you this. For a jape, I actually downloaded that fucking what was it that creepy one where it's like the guy, it's like horse and then the man's head. Oh god, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a, that I oh fuck that that app game that like everyone's like a reverse centaur or whatever. Oh no, it, it's just the one right? dude and like oh is it just one dude? It, it's the one dude and you're the horse tamer and it's just like this, this, this dude's a normal horse. That's, what are you talking about? That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, hello to Brian in the chat. Hello, Brian. Horse Bojack. No, but I actually know someone who worked on that show. The first se first two seasons, anyway. That's cool. This is from uh, Jade Eternal, parentheses, Mega Mom. Is he the good cop or the bad cop? Uh, what is... Uh, what is? Oh, it's Pops Robbie. Oh, see, here's the thing. You gave Pops Robbie eyes at the end of his like little tendrils that shoot electricity. Oh, wait, no, that's his eyebrows. I'm sorry. I thought yeah, yeah, no, they're coming out from because here. Of, yeah. Because of where we're sitting, this light blue almost seems like it was white. So I was just oh, like, yeah, he's yeah. got like little creeper eyes. And I'm like, that's <laughs> silly. And that means he would be a flump or a beholder. And that's also amazing. Thank you very much. That's cool. Yo, Lady D. Or, yep, yeah, Lady, Lady D. D. All right. Mm -hmm. Yep, sorry. From this distance, it's really hard to see. Lady D with the gross word, the red cap. With a with a me th this man is such a gross character and I I can't wait for him to return. Ugh. Reminds me of an episode of Goosebumps, where like lawn mo lawn 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 gnomes were evil. Yes, yeah. and it also <laughs> and I instantly also see those flying masks going towards that girl where she put a mask on for Halloween and made her yeah. into a raving bitch. I think that was the first episode of that entire show, um, but yeah, that was, was, was one of the only ones I ever saw. Oh, you don't know what a flump is? Uh, is house a flump is a beholder but good what that exists yeah okay <laughs> from a uh, gita zeke or gita re because uh, we know the other mm -hmm. the other name down here hey, wait is there a mosquito on your face did someone call for help oh red's gonna go in there don't worry she's gonna fix the problem with her mage hand of fire it's all good even more uh gita re odd slow snake the man, the man's almost 600 pounds. How? How could this be? Dude, al dude alligator things? Allega al crocodiles? Crocodiles? Gator dials. Gator They're dials. very stealthy. What about caimans? No, you can smell them a mile away. <laughs> More gator -y. Ben is back while on his plane that is not taken off. Ben, you should go back to flying the plane, man. Come on. Stop Stop looking at the screen and fly the plane. <laughs> Wake. Have you seen Odslow for a minute? Oh, oh, modern AU family with this poor child. Oh, we're just going to use... We just vector the crocodile, the poor bastard. There he goes. Just flip him down the stairs. See? <laughs> Stealthy. Uh, uh, Kepler oh, thing. yeah, from uh, from Kiefer Stone. Kiefer Stone. Cressome did a bunch of fan art for other past ones. Oh, yeah, this is for uh, hopefully us fighting Arceus. We'll see. <laughs> That's great. Still a god! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alrighty. 
And this is from Asian Tim. Oh, this is Serpentera, uh, our Onyx. We set out to stall the the last gym leader who took a billion hits more than they should. Your sacrifice was, was not in vain. You guys, uh... You guys have re really, like... So how much of a strategy has this occurred in? Like, how much of this strategy has occurred? Not much. Like, just very recently. The meat, the meat shield strat? Yeah, the meat shield strat. <laughs> just very recently. All right. Now we move on to... Oh, my God. It, it sucks it's sitting over on this side. Silent Sardines? Or am I crazy? Yes, that's, that's what that word is. All right. It's Grammy looking at a torpedo snail. <laughs> which in that game we've made uh, we've made it uh, out that torpedo snails can contract vampirism. What? Yep. Okay. We have tiny little snails that just walk around and then they stick out their little proboscis and shoot a needle out. Do they make you a vampire? Yes. Oh, that's terrifying. Why why aren't <laughs> they exterminated? Cuz they just show up wherever. They were they were on oh, an entire ship on an island. Oh, that's terrifying. They just cover burn the ship. whole burn the whole thing. <laughs> I think they kind of did at the end. Okay. More Marvel, uh, Marvel Poison. Uh, oh, they're great. During an AMA, we discussed about how we were mixing characters together, and here's a couple of results. Oh, fusions. We got some fusions going on. It, it's always a neat art exercise to like try and fuse characters together and make it look good. Isn't it? In a, it's an animation exercise, actually, where mm -hmm. uh, Ezra and Eloy. That's cool. Ooh, Pro that's fun. Like, proper Eloy. Uh, where you... Uh, there's an animation Eloy and Gore. How do you dragon donkey? What? Isn't that a Kieran? Not necessarily. They're like, they're like a unicorn yeah, deer horse, horse dragon. dragon thing. Ah, uh, here's Gore and it. Okay, that's fair. A brass dragon oh, that's really and a cool. fairy dragon. This is a really cool art exercise uh, in animation where it's take three animals, only break break off each part of uh, break off a different part of them, and then mush them together into so one creature, mm -hmm. and then actually animate how it would walk. Oh, okay. I feel like I've heard of that. That's, that sounds like fun. And uh, here's the full set. Nice. Thank you very much, Marvel. Great work as usual. This one is from Jade Eternal. I wonder if the <laughs> oh uh oh yep bust in here mm -hmm. <laughs> i wonder if there's rule 34 nedra this is exactly how i feel just everyone just pops in <laughs> fuck you son would you like to take a seat <laughs> <laughs> why don't you take a seat take a scrub mm -hmm. just walks in with his fucking gun arm why don't you take a seat <laughs> take a seat right over here then uh jen harvey with a good old pudding. That's cute. It is quite adorb. Oh, it's paint, too. It is, nice. yeah. I was about to say, is that acrylic? Yeah. It looks Looks like, like it is. <laughs> that's the mod's thumbnail. Yeah, that's the <laughs> thumbnail. Yeah, it is. That it, it kind of <laughs> is. All right. And Tyson, Tyson Crevier. All righty. And, uh... Oh, it's red... Oh, is it? Is it Red and Onslow? Some Nintendo AU. So, ah, so then like that a King totally K. is Rule it. And, and Mario sort of thing going on? Yeah, we got a Coop, we got a Coop and Mario situ uh, situation going on. Jesus, would? I mean, I guess if you put a shell on Onslow's back, he would be Coop. I, I think that's supposed to be the, the villain from Donkey Kong, King K. Rule, but I could be wrong. But, that's like, what I thought at first, like and that, then I he, saw the Mario. Yeah, yeah, I, th I think it's just Nintendo in general. Like, it, it doesn't say Mario. So, yeah. so 90s video game cartoon logic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, because King K. Rool wears the cape. Oh no! What the <laughs> fuck is that? Oh, I know what this is. This is terrible. That's some Hannibal shit. Oh no! Psycho Space Cow. This is Grammy. She killed Onslow. Oh. And she made the fucking Metal Gear hat. Like, uh, it's nothing, Grammy. Yeah. Like, it's nothing, Grammy. Because she wants to be stealthy. <laughs> Look at my hat. <laughs> Sacred ingredient. Mystic Wings cosplay. 
<laughs> oh, that's that's really good. Yep, yeah, th this is exactly the point. Is because Onslow accidentally shot Grammy in the back with a grape shot cannon. <laughs> so now she's holding a grudge. So now there's this 400 pound lizard man crocodile boy, just like <laughs> jet jet set scared of walking anywhere because Grammy's walking around. That looks really good. I like the expression. I love it too. It's really good. The Metal Gear hat. Yeah. Yeah. More Jade Eternal. Merman scum, demon spawn. Oh. The characters hating on each other. And this is the turn heel. This is the heel turn attack. Oh, they're doing yeah, the. Yeah, this is a reference to Naruto. Yes, Naruto yep. stuff. I, I know that one. <laughs> You know that? That's a pretty... <laughs> oh, thank God. You guys, the guys that know anime are here. Thank God. That'll counter me out super well. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's Hashirama and Madara, you Philistine. Don't you know anything about anime? What the frick? No, they're standing on their heads. Bodacious Blue they're Jay. No, I... First fan art, a casual, uh, some casual wonders, and Ed getting angry at Wake. It's quite common. Quite common. I love that Nedra's got a camcorder of the whole <laughs> thing. <laughs> and Plisket's sitting back there eating chips. Mm -hmm. This is good. This is good. Thank you. We got one of, uh, from Oh Lady my god, D. I love how this looks. People fighting? Better think of a cutting remark and make him stop. Hey, you big dummy! That is Eloy's catchphrase. <laughs> that is vicious mockery. Every time he says, hey, you big dummy, it deals four psychic damage to someone. <laughs> Full-proof plan what, what, by Eloy. Wasn't there a character in Planescape that actually, like, did that? Like, he yelled out insults? And, like, that was his main thing? If if he did, then... I think it was a big floating skull. Mm. <laughs> like, his main thing was yelling insults at people. Yep, I remember what you're talking about now. Oh, man, Artemis says, reminds me of Angela Anaconda. I see it. I see it. Yeah, I see it too now. Do you know Angela? Angela Mon is a ultimate form Digimon. <laughs> oh my god, I remember that fucking padding they did at the start <laughs> yeah. of the movie. The one time I was ever exposed to Digimon in full, oh, and that's that was, what that I was, got. Yeah, that was the you, you best. You watched one. the Digimon movie? I watched the Digi. Well, I saw a couple of episodes, but I never really cared that much. The theatrical debut of the hit song All Star. Yep. <laughs> People think it's Shrek, but it's not. No, it's not. It's... Or at least for animated. It might have been an Inspector Gadget, but I haven't confirmed that. All Star was an Inspector Gadget? It well, might have was been. It, it might have been. I don't which remember. would be the first showing of in the theater. This is a Google search right after this. I know. <laughs> we have to know. We have to know. Mystic Wing cosplay, getting the three main uh, characters from the D and D uh, games as dogs. Go on a far and away like yep. advent uh, what was it called? Homeward bound adventure. Yep. Homeward Bound, uh, was that Boy Boykin or am I crazy? Boykin Spaniel? Yeah, I think yes. that's what it says. Yep. I should know this because I fucking had like nine dogs when I was a kid. I had, my parents worked for a boxer adoption rescue oh, uh, really? agency and they had prize winning dogs and we had nine of them when I was a kid. God bless their souls. They were all fucking awesome dogs. They were Aww. really cool. I love them. Uh, Ezra as a pharaoh hound. I've always wanted one. I always thought Pharaoh Hounds were super cool. And Eloy the Corgi. That's cute. I'd want a Corgi if they weren't nightmares to train. Uh, Inspector Gadget, <laughs> 1999, had the all-star soundtrack. I googled it for you. Thank you! <laughs> now I need to go watch fucking Inspector Gadget tonight. Thanks. Oh, don't you? Oh, don't I? Don't I? I, I remember when someone flew into the Yahoo logo, and I went Yahoo, and that, and that was the joke. All oh, right, because that was a big, that was a <laughs> that funny, was a huge thing at the time. That was a funny, sir. Under the you, the Yahoo sign. Hang on, I'm looking up when the Digimon movie came out. I, I think it was early aughts. Uh, no, oh frick, it was 2000. Yeah. Okay, so whatever. Did you want the movie still has the first animated uh, film to feature the hit song All All, All Star? Okay. Uh, from, oh, excuse me, Elico, or am I? Yeah, Elico. Elico. Oh, Hanslow. There's nowhere to hide from Grammy. She's everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking face is so good. <laughs> That's great. It's so good. <laughs> Thank you so much. 
And uh, mm -hmm. Josh Medley. Yes. Yep. And it's it's that Stitch scene. You oh, all know. Oh yeah. You all know it with Nedra oh, as uh, Lilo and uh -huh. it as Stitch. Is it accurate? Like, is it? <laughs> um, is it? Ac not really. Oh, okay. It's it. It had no care about what it was doing in it. It had no care of its station in life. It was an alien creature in a zoo that the guys just took out of a purple worms, uh, a giant like tremor style worm sort of like enclosure. This was the alien species. Oh, okay. They yeah. took him out, and then Ned was just like. Okay, well, I can't have my flaming horse nightmare pet. Can I have this instead? <laughs> yeah, it with teeth. Dude, you don't know if it has teeth. No one's bothered to look. Colorful boy. This appears to be... I think this is all of Wake's, like... Wake being trained by his right, master. Right, right. Yeah. His ah. two brothers watch. Ah, so this is their interpretation of how uh, Wake's adopted family would be at the monastery. Yeah, so he's got he's got weights on it on his on, on his wrists there, and like balancing sake on his head, I think. Yes. Yep. And something under his butt. Yeah, it's uh, it's those those burning incense sticks they put down there, so oh, you okay. can't can't squat too far. Oh, okay. And there's good old Sheldon, his tortle brother. Because he used that alias to hide himself <laughs> from those who didn't even know who he was in the first place. <laughs> uh, Fun Boy Zero or Fawn? I Farm Boy. Farm Boy Zero. I'm going to assume... Yep, this is it. This is a very uh, romanticized dragon oh, okay. version of it. And I really love that. And then here's the main boys. Oh, I like that. This is, a, this is sitcom, lads. Yeah, yeah. And then Might and Rock. I love you so much. Oh, dear. He's treating me like a father again. Oh, fuck. Thank you very much. Those are really good. And then from Kim, we got a whole huggy bunch of everyone. Oh, that's so cool. Yep, this, this is a big old picture of everyone on uh, from the TFS at the table. That's awesome. Yep, this is a really good piece. Thank you. And even though, and we also have non-canon boy Mumja in the background. <laughs> That's fun. From the insightful panda. Oh, the Infinity Gauntlet. Oh, okay. With the badges. Yeah, yeah. That's rad. That looks so cool. I've seen the stages of it in work. Oh, sorry. That's fun. Oh, no, no, you're fine. No! No! Oh, no. Uh, oh, God. Akkadian Creative? Yep, Akkadian Creative. Mm. Thank you for this gopher Brian Cranston. <laughs> the dwarf alchemist who's able to actually create drugs out of Yit's secretions. Oh, okay. <laughs> Breaking Yit. Thank you very much. From uh, Rory uh, Feidler. Oh, that's going to be hard to read. Uh, there you go. There you go. Sorry, wake up seeing someone else. Hello. <laughs> so cool, Mr. Castor. Will you train me to be a lawyer just like you? <laughs> <laughs> Caster just takes everything away. I also like how he like slowly. He looks like a uh, a very mild mannered Beavis. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> Bunghole. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh. I am cornhole. <laughs> I need teepee for my bunghole. <laughs> <laughs> what? Bag, bag, bag. Pull my heist trigger. <laughs> From Cream Deluxe. That's good. Kind of reminds, is... kind of reminds me of like the berries and cream. Yep. <laughs> Hi, little... Artists, please do me a favor. Look up on YouTube the berries and cream Skittles commercial. <laughs> Ezra, 
is a half elf. You have your mission. <laughs> you have your fucking mission. Go do it. I'm glad I could be of some help. No, you <laughs> helped out immensely today. From VG Kid, future deity Risp and his best shark buddy Pliskin, now in stained glass form. Oh, cool. This is so cool. Thank you. Ah, and they even show you like all the the ways they did it from work in progress to uh to finish. That is very very awesome. Thank you. Nice. I actually like the one the one without the lines. Uh this one? Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. That again, stained glass style and yeah. that's so fucking rad. Hi probate. Thank you for the 1000 hits with the I'm a young lad who loves berries and cream. <laughs> A cynical spirit. Uh, rounding out the main trio, we now have Organization 13 and Heartless versions of Eloy. Loxy? Yes, that's Eloy with an X. And the Dark Mountain. <laughs> hey, you big dummy. Uh, from Season Morales. Did I hear Talit? Oh, <laughs> Talit, Talit Agent uh, Ezra. There he goes. Off to make his next scheme. <laughs> so good. Thank you. That's good. And from Plenty of Bacchus, boy. A lot of Bacchus in that yep. one. Lot. Eloy versus Panic, the musical bard battle of the century. Some more Unexpectables via uh, oh, DFS okay. at the table stuff. So, so That's like cool. So Thank you. De you. Devil went down to Georgia situation. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, that's pretty good. <laughs> From Chimera Chan, I've I've seen I've seen Chimera Chan make oh, wow. these make these comics. It's so good. And we're reading it manga style, so from left to right. Ah. Just this fucking scene alone. Here. Write down this one for D. It makes a da sound like deer, demolish, destroy. You saying I should throw Calliope mm. off the ship? Yes. No! Mm. Also, I love that he's in, like, fucking, like, sit down, let's have a talk in my study outfit. That's cool. Kind of reminds me of, of the, the song from Spongebob. <laughs> Efforts for fire! <laughs> Burns down the, the whole, whole town! He was for uranium! Bombs! <laughs> Thank you very much. This is from Sage Green Cat. Ezra, I need you to tell me every th everything is going to be okay. Don't jump! Oh, this is when uh, Ezra went on a fucking drug trip. Oh. He's looking at the Fey... Like, something from beyond the Fey Wilds is speaking to him and drawing blood on the walls. <laughs> Thank you, Sage Green Cat. This is so hard to read. Not not the name. Uh, MC Craft Topics. Uh, a little pixel art made of Wake and Nedra looking out into the stars. Is this picture tiny? Oh my god, it's tiny. I can't read that from here. Uh, Wake, uh, you know something my master once told me? Nedra, does it have to do with punching? Uh, Wake, not quite. Aw. He once said that people become stars when they die. I'd like to think that everyone does. He didn't say? Nope. See, I, I, I can read it. I, 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 don't, I don't know what it means. But. Yeah, yeah, no, that's fine. <laughs> Thank you very much, though. Okay, so let me explain this one because oh, wow. Shannon Lee here. Oh, that's sick. Okay, so when I was talking about how tieflings look in uh, Dungeons & Dragons, like, last week, D&D uh, &D 4 and 5 has made, like, tieflings, which are devil people and demon people, mm -hmm. They're more romanticized and look a lot more pretty now. Yeah. When, when back in the day, they looked like fucking hideous goblin people. Oh, okay. And I said, I, they, they still say in the store, in the canon that it's like, there could be ugly ones, but the more common ones that people are now akin to are the pretty ones. Mm -hmm. So I said, fuck that. While I did want some like nice looking ones and some ugly looking ones, I will always defend ugly tieflings. So I That's said, really cool. here, I, I was like, let's bring back hashtag ugly tieflings. And this was the first. This is like one of the few first responses. That's awesome. It's really good. Nightmare fuel Nedra. 
Oh, it's so good. Yeah, it's awesome. I, I like the, I like the spikes at the end of the at the, at the end of the elbows. Oh yeah. I love the bladed fucking elbow and shit. Yeah, yeah that's some McFarlane it, shit, dude. Yeah, it reminds me of Magnola. Yeah, I get Magnola too. But oh god, thank you so much. This is great. Either way, those are two good artists to be compared to. Another one from uh, Shannon Leap. This is the Joe Massacre and the Hippocampus or Nightmare Ghost Rider. <laughs> so we found out that the God of Death has a has a horse that is constantly on fire and he walks over the surface of the water. Ooh, fun. And he only goes by the name Joe Massacre. <laughs> That is such an awesome rendition. I can't wait to show off Joe sooner or later. He's coming. Don't you worry. He's coming to reap them souls. Thank you very much. Oh, and the end state of the uh, the uh, thing from before. I'm sorry. This this one right, coming right here. Oh yeah. Like the full thing. Yeah. The insightful panda. Oh yeah, this is the full comic. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Your ball, your face still looks like a ball sack. Thank you very much, Insightful Panda. This is this is great. That's rad. Be careful. Be careful. It may contain spoilers of a certain movie. Windows updates. No, not now. Yeah, don't, don't yeah do that. Or do it right now. Get on you later. From Brandon. Been a while since I've uh, been back into making fan art, so you decided to make Meads Crew. Ah, Sprite Boys of the Meads Crew. Excellent. That's cool. Thank you very much. Oh. From, uh, Lazame. Shark Pliskin. Complete with peg leg and tattoo. Yep. Peg leg tattoo, and also his... Infamous, somehow on his face, shark beard. <laughs> Ooh. Is this wrist telling the god of death to eat it? <clears throat> yep. yep. From Apeth, wrist flipping off the scary god of death. Oh, that's crazy. I mean, like, I could be your acolyte, but fuck you, I like living. <laughs> just three foot tall little kobold just going, nah. Fuck you. I, I denounce death. <laughs> Thank you. From uh, Rebecca Carolla again. <clears throat> ah, the three main characters. Oh, cool. One with a spear, one tipping that hat, getting them tips, and there's Eloy just looking off at the distance. Yeah, it's adorable. It's a normal day for Eloy. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hmm. From Batman. <laughs> I wonder who this fellow is. <laughs> Wherever he is, he's rocking out. Yeah, he's yeah. uh, he's he's punching that key really hard. He's uh, getting... No, he's grinding a PlayStation Four controller along the strum bar of a Guitar Hero controller because it was every Metallica song at once, and he had to strum for what seemed like twenty beats per second. Sounds like you might have experience with that sort of thing. No, of course. Why would you? Sorry, allergies are flaring up. Uh, from Sean, uh, Sheen Saver. Uh, oh, uh, hi, TFS. I love what you created. I thought that it would be based on the Snagglepuss cartoon, Lieutenant Gore. Everyone has said that. <laughs> I'm okay. I am okay with that. He is not based off of Snagglepuss. He's based off, he's based off the red guy, which is based off another person, but... I can see why you would make that comparison. Lieutenant Gore and Snagglepuss. I like that. <laughs> just in, whatever, whenever that, that character shows up next, just exit stage left. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, it's me. What would fucking scare Gore? Because his actual form is, he takes the form of a human, but he's a dragon, but he's the size of a continent. Oh. So what would scare him to do that? Well, some more adventure time. Yep. Some more adventure time, boys. That's a little difficult to parse. It looks like you can get in a little bit. You can zoom more. in. Yeah, there, there, we go. Go. there we go. There's our zoom in. Just a, by God, that's a huge image. Uh, 
Not going to tell you how to do stuff, but you might want to cut the dead air. <laughs> Just a little bit. But beyond that, this is a very good Calliope and a very cute Ziaka. These, these girls are adorable. That's awesome. That's Thank cute. you. Yeah, try to cut that out next time. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. You got two cartoonists in the room, and we're just, I'm, I'm sure even you were just, you were just <laughs> I, like... I, I was thinking it, but I, I don't know. <laughs> oh, no, I, I'll be the asshole and say it. Cut but, the dead air. No, but that's for their benefit, so that people can really... Yeah, yeah, can, yeah. Can, can we're not, we're not saying this to be yeah. mean. It's just that for the benefit of your picture, cut the dead air. <laughs> yeah. Like, like, you want people to see it. All right, from a random D and D nerd. I wonder what he plays. He sounds like a real fucking huge nerd. I've right. been catching up on the episodes. Hopefully, to catch them live soon. You found your favorite character so far, and it's Nedra. It seems, seems like that. There's a lot of that going around. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, she is a bar. She is this tall barbarian woman, who like is just the innocence of a child. From uh, Alisa. Ezra panicking, uh, panicked management of his crew shenanigans. <laughs> yeah, Ezra kind of almost had like several heart attacks last episode. Ooh, ooh. I'm gonna butcher this name, and I am so goddamn sorry. Yako Kilonen. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for that. All right, and I also right. lost all the pictures. So let me go ahead and try and find it. There again. we go. Ah, here we go. This is uh this is some amazing 3D artwork. This is in Sketchfab? That's crazy. That's in Sketchfab? What the fuck? Yo. It's good work. That is astounding, dude. That's awesome. Yo, thank you very much. That is fucking awesome. Good. Hold on. Let me see what the titles he gives him. Acidite Centaur, Bard, Good Boy, Ghostbuster, and Team Carrier. <laughs> I think Ben would love all those titles. In 3D. Especially the ghost the ghost uh the Ghostbuster. More uh Gita Ree. Uh after con after the conclusion of the crossover and collab with MSFS Arts, somehow that somehow got skipped in the retweet twice. Okay. I'm um, sorry that happened. I felt like showing the consequences of the Saturday morning Cleo pretending to be a modern Cleo and Grammy related shenanigans. Hmm. Two Cleo uh, catchers in their respective world. See, the problem is, is that this is a completely Nick made character. So I don't even I don't know. I'm just like, oh, where does the lore happen for this character? Because I this is a made up character for the Saturday morning one shot. Oh, OK. So, so, so we were just under-equipped to, yeah, to comment. I, so, of all the people here, we're kind of unequipped with Cleo Catra stuff. Sorry. Cute, cute art, though. No, it is cute art, yeah, though. Yeah, it looks great. It's very good. Thank you. It's like, unfortunately, yeah, it's like, I'm the GM. I should know all this stuff. I'm like, yeah, but I didn't make the Saturday morning character, so I don't know how Nick's character would react in that scenario. A lot of AUs. There's a lot of fucking AUs now. A lot that even I can't keep up. The otaku Brit. Uh, I was going to do something D&D &D related, and then you had no idea how to draw anything in regards to that, so you just did pudding. That's cool. It's still good. Uh, Charlotte Vandrell. I'm not sure if I said that last name correctly. I apologize. Uh, first fan art ever you ever drawn in ages. You really tried. Keep up the good work. That's the storm giant. Oh, that's cool. That's literally the cliffhanger we ended on the last episode. Oh, where wow. Where a, a fucking storm giant is just looking over them, over the ship. I, I keep, love... I keep seeing like almost like a Monty Python like animation happening with just gulping it up. <laughs> that, that this whole ending sequence was exactly the reference I was going for for the Monty Python cartoon. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy you got that reference. I was hoping someone else would. And I'm just like, guys, do you know what it is? And then you got it, and I'm, I'm now I now have validation. Thank you. 
from uh, Dressel Silverwing. First attempt at a speed paint. You did this within an hour to challenge yourself before bed. That's awesome. And that's Skrung with his not-yet-implemented gun arm. <laughs> I love that everyone's making him have an X-Buster at this point. That's fun. They're all working towards getting him that X-Buster. Oh, is this another? Apply Ace to Burn. The pic uh, You really like the word picture that Zito drew last night. You tried your hand at a wide perspective shot to please how it would turn out in the end. Ooh, that's Yeah! Cool. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Oh, that's so dope. Reminds me of a lot of, like, HP Lovecraft, like... Yeah. Uh, yep. Art. Dark and stormy night, shit's coming at you, and it's way bigger than the planet should be. <laughs> that's cool. That's some fucking Lovecraftian shit happening. That's so good! Yeah. Thank you very much, Apply Ace to Burn. <laughs> a Q attack on Titan music, yeah. From uh, NDJMR, uh, this is Nemesis Nedra uh, with her father's rage. When her father's rage takes over, when the voice in her head says to kill, this is what you get. Oh, okay. <clears throat> This is very, very impressive. I like this. I love I love this sketch work. I also love the suit of armor you gave her. Yeah, and like the little crown, like kind of like Hellboy 2. Yep. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Nedra's been getting a lot of Hellboy references as of late, which I don't mind. That's pretty cool. Ooh. From uh, Cecily G, uh, uh, G. Lease? I bought Cecily GC. Cecily GC. Yeah. Today's episode mm. of the Nuzlocke has confirmed Narcoma is uh, to be Reducto. Oh, yeah. I think we just gave him that voice. Back off! Um, that... In case you haven't noticed, I got a shrink gun. <laughs> uh, from Akira Carrero, uh, commissions are open. Horrible short-term memory for these things, but here's the blue boy. So, oh, wait. I think I know what's happening. I think they mis they mistook uh, Brundle's uh, scale color because William Smith was the blue boy. Yeah, yeah. But I don't think this looks like this. This looks like uh, Brundle because he's got a uh, he's got that it ain't me, I ain't no fortunate son vibe going yeah, on. Yeah, and like what looks like camo pants right there. Yep. So 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 yeah, I don't I don't I think uh, what what was Brundle's uh, scale color again? He was green. Green. Okay, I thought so. Oh, boy. From uh, Retro Renegade. Decided to do this post thanks to Marvel Poison for letting her use the flag redes uh, the flag design. It's all the guys working at the table. Oh, cool. <laughs> and, and you good, think the dice will help you. And, and, a, and a good challenge to try and, like, show who people are while including as few features as possible. Yep. I love negative space drawings. It really... When you have a strong silhouette... And a commanding, uh, commanding ability to show negative space in a silhouette. It's a really good sense of character mm. design. This is very good. Thank you. Yeah. From uh, Nick at Square. It's totally going to do cannon doodling uh, with the captain, but uh, she would never in life made two, two one with blush and one without. Oh, so it's red. Oh, okay. Red and bunny outfit. Ah, one with and without blush. Yeah. <laughs> yep, that red. Risque red. Thank you. More Gitari. Uh Thank goodness they have the collective one as their GPS should something like happen to wake. Oh. Oof. Yep. Uh, my throat hurts. I need water. Wait, wait. I always wanted to try out this healing punch thing. I s ever since you saw him might try it. Red, you just, you depict Red as just so mean to, to wake, and I love it. Because he kind of deserves half of the time. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Speaking of Mike Mignola from before. Yeah, right? Uh, Moppus. First time trying to draw with a brush pen and coloring with Photoshop. Dude, awesome. Photoshop, like, if you can master drawing and illustration on Photoshop, you got it pretty good. This is pretty damn awesome. Yeah, like Magnolia, and also kind of like the 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 stuff in Metal Gear, like the the Talking Head stuff. Yep. Mm, yeah. 
Like, like similar art style. This is very good, Moppus. Thank you. Yeah, it's great. From Jade Eternal, Nedra's true lineage revealed. Before we click this, I'd just like to say, Not canon. Nedra, I'm sorry about Yit. I wish we could have saved him, but Nedra, are you okay? I think something's wrong with my... <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> That's great. I'm, I'm just like, should I resend that not canon just a little bit just for the jape? <laughs> just, just maybe. I think there's something wrong with my eyes. <laughs> and uh, Corey Brody... Uh, Team Four Star, I am the prince of all penguins. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's all. That's all your champion or the starters. Yeah, starters. Yeah. That's cool. Also, there is uh one other picture that's not put on here that I would like to find real quick, done by Caitlin because she did our uh, she did the thumbnail for the Kobold one shot and everyone's Kobolds oh, okay. were made. So I'd like oh. to show that off real quick. Absolutely. There, there she is. It's going to be done. There it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, yeah. I saw this one. Yep. I just wanted to end it off on this one. This is fucking superb. Yeah. And yep. I, I actually know about this one. <laughs> yep. So I uh, I used this one, but I credited Caitlin on, on, the, on the video itself. Caitlin, this is awesome. Thank you very much for doing this. Yeah, it's, it's, re it's really cool to see to see people, like, make stuff ba based on... Yeah, that looks awesome. ...character I, I farted out. <laughs> I didn't have to do that. Yeah, but I know it was on here, and I was just like, why is this not retweeted? That's criminal. I'm going to fix that right now. Yeah. Let's see if that uh, popped up on the page real quick. Yep, there it is. There you go. It's official. It is now <laughs> official. I have deemed it so. <laughs> Though you, you, could, you could argue that putting it on the thumbnail made it more official. No. No, no. Now it's super official. Now, now yeah. it's really official. Okay. Now, now, now it's seal of complete <laughs> approval person finish dot com all right well thank you very much for showing up uh to the fan art special stay tuned for six o'clock for god what are we doing fuck nope. i don't know either and yeah, nobody knows we'll find out together i guess i'm gonna go eat my nugs now before i go hit kieran like i promised before yep he's doing it i'm doing it it's happening it's happening